Hello, YouTubers out there. Um, this is Maximo Milkman coming out with an update for the Make uTorrent Speeds Faster video that I made about two years ago. Uh, a lot of things in uTorrent have changed since then, and I just want to give you guys an update on the settings that uh, you should be using on this uTorrent. Okay, I'm just going to jump right into it. So you open up uTorrent, go to Preferences, and start it out uh, at Connection. You're going to have to port forward your modem or your router to this port or any other port of your choosing, but this is just the one I personally use, 47624. And if you do port, port forward this, you don't need to enable UPnP port mapping, so you could just turn this off. And now on to bandwidth. But first, before I go on to bandwidth, I want to stress that if you do not open up your port, your speeds are going to be very slow, so you're, you got to make sure that your modem or your router is port forwarded, otherwise your speeds are going to be extremely slow. Alright, bandwidth. Alright, here we go. This is what I have in my bandwidth. 65 for maximum upload rate, and alternate upload rate when not downloading is 0, and maximum download rate is set to 0, global maximum number of connections set to 1890, Maximum number of connected peers per torrent is set to 2329. Number of upload slots per torrent is set to 14. And you check this box right here, which is by default, I believe, selected. All right, now let's talk about uh, why these numbers are so high. Honestly, these numbers to me seem really high for a lot of people. And I've seen a video like two years ago, and this is what the settings were. And it made my connection faster and then I came out with a video and a lot of people were saying their speeds were faster so I would just say put these values in 1892329 and 14 and if your speeds seem slow cut these numbers by half so half of 1890 half of 2329 and half of 14 and put that there if it if it's not as fast as you think it should be or I mean if it's if your internet's like becoming if you torrent is becoming really weird just cut these numbers by half all right now to BitTorrent this these are the boxes that I have checked in BitTorrent and I believe most of these are set by default the only thing I changed was protocol encryption outgoing enabled and this should be default now to the advanced part um, uTorrent has made an update where uh, goes in alphabetical order these names and the values that you're going to be changing are the values that have a star next to it. So, BT allows same IP has a star, set it to true. And I will go down the list. BT enable tracker, true, BT no connect to services, false. BT send have to seed, false. Keep on going down, down, down. Graphical user interface bypass search redirect true. IP filter dot enable false. Net dot max half open starred to sixty six. Net dot outgoing port fifty. Net WSA event one fifty. Peer dot disconnect inactive interval nine hundred. Q don't count slow download, false. Q don't count slow upload, false. And I believe that is it. So these are all the values that I've changed in my uTorrent. It's basically all these exact same settings from the previous video that I was getting good uh, feedback on saying it helped out a lot of people. It's all the same stuff, basically, except now it's in 1.82 version of uTorrent, which is actually pronounced MooTorrent, as uh, somebody posted on my video. So that's the correct way you pronounce uTorrent, which is not actually the right way to say it. It's MooTorrent. So I guess from now on, I'll start calling it MooTorrent. Anyways, back to the video. Uh, this video may help out uh, let's say 75% of people, but there's going to be 25% of people that absolutely despise these settings and just bash me for it and say, oh, my uTorrent is screwed, and this and that, and they yell at me on the comments. So, 
I suggest if this does not work for you, just uninstall uTorrent and reinstall uTorrent. It'll have default settings and you can't cry to me about it. But I believe this will help out a lot of people. So this is Maximo Milkman from YouTube providing an update from my previous video. And that's the end of that.